Well, all right, everyone. Welcome back to another episode here on Restoration. If you hear my old voice, I ain't been preaching too hard. I can't do that, but I, I don't have much of a voice. Don't really feel all that good, and it's cold. The old man gave me his toboggan because I left my hat. Uh, so we, uh, we're we here today. Yep, we're going after a bug. we uh, we insecting it today. We're going after a little Volkswagen bug. What year is it? He said it's a 70, but I don't believe it because it's got the small tail lights and all on it. I don't know what year it is. So he said it's a 70, but the old man don't believe him. Uh, so you don't know, I don't know would it be year. older? I think it's probably older. He thinks it's older. So we may do some investigating and see what your bug this is. Uh, but y'all, we're going to see if we can get it running. We're going to see maybe if we can even get it moving because uh, we don't want to drag the old, we probably are going to drag the old man's truck down here, but we want to try to get it out. And if we can get it out, uh, we're going to uh, see if we can run it up on the dolly and the old man's going to get it home. But the old bull had fun with this bug and beat it all to pieces, but we're going to show it to you after the intro. If having fun was against the law, we would be guilty as charged. All we are is shady shade tree mechanics from Butts County. Yep, the tail end of the world, just having fun. If you're interested in this kind of journey, come along. I'm David, I go by Rev here on YouTube. My daddy, also known as the old man, my wife, Nikki T. All we like to do is have fun and enjoy ourselves. So if you're interested in that journey, if you're interested in not learning how to do it, but just seeing the craziness of how we do it, come along for the journey here on Restoration. I didn't bring any gas. Got to go to the store. I got a jug. I got my little two gallons. I didn't bring. I don't have my. I didn't. I didn't bring any gas. I came in a different truck. Y'all, old pudding gave me some problems. It's been roaring. I don't know if it's rear end. It's got a forward nine inch. So if it is, I can fix it. But I hope it ain't it. Hope it ain't the transmission. Hope it ain't the engine. I've got one universal joint I put on it, and that wasn't good enough. So I got two more to try. So I'm hoping it's just the universal joints. But I left the gasoline in pudding. Oh, gone it. So we ain't got gasoline. The old man's gonna have to go get some, but we'll figure it out. Um, but here she is, 19, whatever. Uh, the old man says he's, uh, I wasn't telling the old man whatever, y'all. I was saying it's a 19 whatever Volkswagen. Uh, we don't know what year it is, um, but we're gonna open it up and see if we can look in the inside. Oh yeah, look at there. What, to go to the store? No. So, do you go on to go get some gas? Yeah. All right. Be careful. All right, y'all. The old man's going to get some gasoline. Look at here. I mean, the seats ain't bad. Interior ain't bad in this old bug. Uh, actually, it looks pretty good. Got a little bit of a uh, little bit of mold. Let's look at the old insurance card. Insurance card does say 1970 Volkswagen Beetle two door. Uh, Chris last issued 1999, so it's been a uh, 20 some odd years, I would assume. Uh, yep, last issue, uh, 99. There's the owner's manual for it, I guess. Uh, I was about to say it all dumped out, but it didn't. Look at that green, y'all. I mean, that could be a pretty little car. Old man thinks it's older than that, but I think it may be it. I don't know if that, I'm about to say that was locked, but got a point set in here. What else? Let's look here tonight. Doesn't really tell us much there. Let's see if this is a new point set or not. Maybe. No, uh, is that new points? Sure is. It's got a brand new set brand new set of points maybe two new set of points i imagine this is condenser no that's a rotor no uh, so we got some different stuff in the glove box which ain't bad um horn ring is gone the rearview mirror is gone but i mean a little bit of cleaning a little bit of cleaning actually got a manual in the back I don't see any uh I don't see any parts that look like they're missing. 
That old bull got all over it now. Let's check the engine bay. Oh, come on. Can't get the engine bay to open up. Of course, we know that's not the engine bay. Engine's in the back of this rig. That would have been a tail light housing, I would assume. It would go right here. <laughs> Man, that bull just gave this thing some doozy now. There is the engine. Oh. And, uh,. Yo, it don't look good of us getting this engine started. I don't know if the old man saw that, but y'all look at that uh, that wheel there. <laughs> I'd say it's got a little bit of boogering that uh, that may more than likely probably ain't gonna work. Uh, I think she's gonna need a rebuild to actually get this off is a big thing. Maybe we can get it going, I don't know. That says expire September of 2001, but it wasn't on the road then. There she is. I reckon we can get it running. We're going to wait and find out. Waiting on the old man to come back with some gasoline, but what y'all reckon is down in that hole? That joker comes out, argh, garland at me. Woo, woo. Mmm. I got a feeling we're gonna make this rascal work. I'm just praying y'all, just praying we're gonna make it work. All right, well, while I wait on the old man to get back, I want to, um, uh-oh, like I already sprayed that and didn't mean to. Uh, I'm gonna try to start lubing up just some of the things on the carburetor, some of the carburetor linkage and all that. Cause I want to, uh, of course, if you look in here, I wanna make sure that all this works as it should, of course. I don't know if it will. It actually feels pretty tight to me. I couldn't move it at all uh, from the, uh, couldn't couldn't move it really at, at uh, <laughs> can't talk. Um, so I'm just actually spraying all that just for that purpose. Once again, if we look down here, um, that don't look good to me. That don't look good at all. Uh, that don't look good at all that don't look good at all so boy we got all kind of rust on all the pulleys but uh we're still gonna give it a go but i got all that lubed up which is a good thing and uh maybe when the old man gets back with some gas we'll start grabbing some tools and really just start him hawing with it and hopefully we can get all this broken up and uh, if we get it all broken up and get it turning i think we can get this old volkswagen to fire off I ain't crossing my fingers, but I'm praying. Now you can't start with a. Oh, he's coming. Yeah. You can't start with an ace or a base car, do it. Uh huh. Turn one up and count to 13, whatever you get. Put it on the bottom. All right, so you can't start with a base car. Put it on the bottom, it don't matter. 10, 11, 12, 13. Now we stop at 13. Uh huh. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We'll put all these back in your jacket. All right. The first thing you do is count out 10. Ten, ten it don't take long. This street don't take long. Count out 10 cars. Four. And this is mathematical and it works in the Five, Turn the top part over. Turn the top part over. Top count two more out over here. Keep them in your hand. Count two more. All right, turn over either one of them you want to at the time. Add 10 more. <laughs> All right, stop where you get. Mm -hmm. Count how many cards you got right there. This works every time. Seven.
Watch out, the old man's going to crank up his chainsaw. He's going to snip some of these off, and then we're going to pull, then we're going to jack it up, and we're going to actually try to lean it over. we got to get new tires on it. We want to get it off Mr. Wayne's Barracuda over here, uh, but we're going to kind of jack it up and move it over. Hey, Mr. Wayne, stepping on them. See if you can. Yeah, come oh. hit them. I was going to come back and get them last because I didn't want to mess up my blade first. You hit that clown a few times. It can... That's where the comet sit right over here, yo. <laughs> yeah, it may have been a piece of chrome or trim that was on something. Oh, that's probably the door trim. There was a door trim and a piece right here. Yep. And that's it. <laughs> <laughs> that bull has got it. Uh, you can straighten it out, old man. <laughs> oh, yeah, we straightened it out all right. Well, y'all, here it is. Um, old man, you want to come back here and look with me? I think our biggest, uh, I think our biggest hurdle is going to be them pulleys. See that pulley there? That pulley there rotted, rotted out. I can put a, I can put a wrench on this and just give it some yeehaw. It's tight. I'm wondering if that may be holding it. You want to do that? Try that first? Yeah. How'd you? I grease. I just sprayed all oh, that just for the. But uh, that uh, <laughs> sitting down in there. I guess that's the timing mark, is it? No, that's part of the thing. <laughs> yeah, it rusted out. It rusted slap out. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're gonna get some wrenches and see if we can turn it. And then if we can, then we'll we're gonna have to take tires off anyway to tow it to the house. But let's see if we can get that to turn. Mr. Wayne said this Volkswagen was pointed in this direction and that old bull turned it in this direction. He grabbed the front end of it swung it around. He had laid it over here on his Barracuda. He the tail lights out of the back of this Barracuda, look. He look. sure did. Yeah. Well, he busted them two on that side. Yeah. This ain't locked, but that motor, <laughs> motor's not turning. It ain't turning there. So maybe we need to get something and put it right there and kind of pry up on that. We can't get the motor ain't turning at this time. Uh, Cause it stuck something down in there. I see. Let's just pry right there and bloop. Or pry right there. No, I wouldn't do it with there. I don't think you're gonna pry with that pulley. I'm pry right there. You we'll get something. it on there. All right, y'all. We're gonna go get another prying tool and see if we can make uh, see if we can make it work. If we can get it to spin, I think we can get it to crank. If we can't get it to spin, we're gonna take wheels off. All right, we're gonna try to get on the uh, crank bolt and clean some of that out. So I'm gonna put that bolt right up there so I can lose it. And then uh, all this right here should come off. Well, maybe it's got another bolt right over there. Well, I just pulled it out of that bolt. There's that piece. Ooh, Nilly. He had all this covered up down there in the hole, ain't it?
Yeah, that's our issue. Uh, our issue is we don't know if it's stuck engine or what. But man, we you didn't bring your vacuum either, did you, old man? That pulley right there ain't no good, y'all. I reckon we can. Uh, That's part of it right there. That went down. Oh man, we can get something and put it on that and just beat like crazy on it. Y'all, we know we're being hard on this little engine, uh, but I think it's a Volkswagen that can take it. Uh, we think we got the engine in neutral. Uh, we hope we do. So we're gonna go put a bolt on, uh, we're gonna put something, a, a socket or something on that, and we're gonna see if we can get this engine to turn. If it'll turn, we're gonna try to crank it up. All right, y'all, Mr. Wayne to the rescue. He uh, he had these, uh, these lugs here. Oh man, oh, oh, that's tightening it. That's tightening it. Wasn't tight to start with. <laughs> it wasn't tight to start with. Maybe that's the best thing to do is go buy us a pulley. That'd be bad. <laughs> oh, I just caught a cramp in my leg. Oh! <laughs> All right, Dad. You want to feel my thing? That cramp just caught when I slipped and I tried to catch myself and that joke was grabbing right now. Woo, woo. All right, uh, you hold this, old man. Hey. See if I can uh, get it to tighten. Maybe it's turning in the pulley it's ain't. No, it's got a key stop. You wouldn't do that way. You'd think. I'll break it. But... Oh, man, it, it ain't, to... like it ain't doing nothing, don't it? <laughs> It couldn't have been that loose, surely. Well, somebody else is trying to turn it. What's it doing, y'all? It's turning. It's turning, y'all. The belt, the pulley ain't no, is it? No. I think in order to get it to pull. Yep, yeah, maybe we need to go a different size. It's starting to slip now. See if the opening is how the opening fits. Fit these are metric. There's some more of these in there. Sugar sack somewhere. Some of these are, these gold ones are electric, but I don't know. I can probably go up there and find you a six point socket that's one and a quarter. That's what you need. Alright, yeah, if that's the size we need, it's a, that's metric? 30. It's a 30? Yep. Alright, that's about right. Now take that round inch and a quarter and grab over that. <laughs> you gonna try it to did it. take the inch and a quarter. I'm gonna try to just tap it. Keep moving, don't it? Keep getting tighter. Is it getting tighter? It is. But with that belt, don't it? It ain't gonna move, is it? So you reckoning we need to uh, take the belt off? Yeah, I think we need to take the belt off. But I don't know where the adjustment is. <laughs> okay. Where's the adjustment? No. no. Yeah, it's a is the adjustment loosening and pulling the, this off? No. Sure to get You ain't gonna take that off. Get the back. I don't see any adjustment on this doohickey here. I can't believe it, it didn't ever tighten up all the way. That big old I bet bolt. you do have to pull this off. Slide this off to get it off. You know how to get it off, old man? I got a pair of snips and snip, snip. We got the number. You go with that? Well, Put the uh, put your socket back on that thing up yonder and see how easy it is to turn with it. This? Yeah. I'm not cutting it off, but I don't. Get... That's turning. You see it moving when you've done that. Yeah, what is stuck is this right, the belt on this. Yeah. Or this. We don't know which one it is. That thing's got to have an adjustment on it. I don't bust your knuckles. Yeah, you... 
That ain't there. Mm -hmm. You must have a whole thing. There's got to be adjustment on that somewhere. This pull off. I had it loose a while ago. One of them pulls off. So just take the whole pulley off. Y'all go down in the junkyard and I can't like this. Not in a junkyard except my own. <laughs> He's getting right in my way trying to kill him, yeah. Do you, do you go to pull apart? Huh. I have before, but not lately. That's how it goes. That's how you get, get it off. It's got an old split pulley on it. Give me all that or lay it somewhere outside there. That's one way to get the belt off. That's probably the way to do it. Take your screwdriver and push it off. No, you can't. And that'll eliminate the... Uh... That's the only belt it's got, ain't it? Yep, that's it. Yep. Ain't got no water pump on it. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't bring no antifreeze with me. We don't need none. We don't! You just don't have antifreeze! <laughs> that rascal there ain't turning. Yeah, that means it's locked, don't it? 32. You want my monster crescent wrench? <laughs> I've got a monster crescent. Next thing is put the starter on it. Put a battery on the starter and see if it do anything. Oh, we can take the spark plugs out and go that route. But right now, that didn't turn, did it? I don't think that did. I hope, hope we ain't stripping it. I don't know how easy they are. <laughs> I'd hate for it just to be slightly froze and we break the crankshaft. <laughs> All right, y'all. So I think the old man wants to play around with the starter and and all those type things. So I guess we could do that. Uh, we could drop some fluid down the spark plugs. We got to clean all this off to get all that off. But uh, that's what we're going to do. And we'll uh, see you in a minute. We pulled the seat out for him to have somewhere to see it. And we wanted to look in here and see if we can figure out where the battery goes and the battery ain't even in the car it's sitting on the ground look at there he just rusted a whole slam through it uh we said the interior was good and it is but that right start battery is uh sitting on something else so we need a battery box for it we decided to do the wrong thing before we drag it out old man's gonna tap the starter just gonna tap it you tapping it might have to push the clutch in you ain't even getting the key all the way in it we got the other one in it the one that's got the black plastic on it and i thought well maybe that's the wrong one Looks like the same key. And I guess it goes in that way. I turn it. It went in. Look at the wheel a little bit. No. Uh oh. That went. Oh, the lights come on. Huh. Did we get? I. Yeah. She stuck. <laughs> oh, ain't spinning is it? Nope. It started work so. <laughs> ain't even budging, huh? Nope. That's one thing about an old Volkswagen. You ain't got nowhere flat. You can lay your bolts and everything. So you got to find another spot for them. Uh, oh, there's that. I ain't got that wheel off. I don't reckon that'll turn. I was wondering if we could look in there and see the spark plugs any better, but that's the best thing that's happened so far. Actually, he got this car. <laughs> he got this car from my cousin Clint. Oh, really? When we all worked uh, the car boat cake in one road. When we get that. Phew! Mm -hmm. Man, I went to the doctor the other day. I was eating clay. What's wrong with you? Yeah, he told me, uh, he told me since I was eating clay, it was bad. He said, but it'd be really bad if I started pooping bricks. <laughs> I've been, I've been hacking, hacking up flame. That ain't no fun. Oh. Whew. I last week. I, I really, last Wednesday, Thursday, 
You must have gave it to me, Mr. Wayne. I've been feeling bad all week, came. too. I got it right after the tornado or all that went on. Blew some of that mess in here. And, and then I still don't feel like eating nothing. Well, it ain't stopping my wanting to eat. I've been, I, I've been eating. Eating ain't bothering. It's just everything else. Can't breathe. Yeah, just all say head cold. Just... Well, you know, and I try to smoke, and it compounds the issue. <laughs> yeah, it will. <clears throat> and you can't sleep at night. And if I take some of that cough medicine, then I can't hack it up out of my lungs. Yeah. That That's... makes it even worse. Mm hmm But a hot shower... It just seems to help more than anything. Just going in there and late getting a shower. Yeah. Yeah, that gastrologist I went to, though, he told me that uh, poop jokes aren't his favorite, but they're a solid number two. <laughs> a little 13 inch or 14. What, what size tires? There's the first spark plug out. It ain't it ain't too bad. I mean, it's got carbon on it, but you can tell it's been uh, been used. We got one out, so we're gonna spray. Uh, we're gonna spray a little bit down there, and we'll just keep going all the way around. We got, I think, four of them. I don't think it's the six cylinder. We got four. We'll get them out, spray it, and uh, then we'll try to break the engine loose again. If we get her broke loose, I think she'll crank. Keep in playing. It's fun, y'all. Have to remind ourselves sometimes how much we enjoy this, especially when we're not feeling all that good. But we're gonna try to make some content for y'all. Hopefully y'all enjoy us trying to get this bug to run. It's been playing in the dirt a little too much, but we're gonna try to get it. Y'all, I think everything on this car is locked up. I think these spark plugs are locked up on it. They ain't coming off easy. Uh, but we're gonna get them out. We'll get them out, the old man's got some mystery oil we're gonna put in there. And we're gonna keep working on this crank, keep working on the, uh, keep working on it. And when we get it, uh, when we get it broke loose, then we can start worrying about fire and all that. We just want to hear it run. Uh, these little engines ain't hard to rebuild. That may be fun for us to do on the channel. Uh, but this one needs every fender on it. Every body panel needs to be straightened. It's got a decent interior and good glass. That's about what you bought, old man. <laughs> I didn't buy it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's about what you got. Yeah. All right, y'all. We're getting our cold drinks. Uh, mine's a Mountain Dew and the old man's got a Coca-Cola. Uh, old man, you know where, uh, you know where sheep go, uh, on vacation? Uh, the Bahamas. 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 <laughs> I didn't even say it right, but it's Bahamas. You know what the duck says after he gets through eating his dinner at the restaurant? Just put it on my bill. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. That's through with the corniness. I'm going to, uh, we're going to drink these, let that engine sit a second, and then we're going to get over there and start working on that crank, and hopefully we can get this little engine to break loose. Them pistons can't be no more than about that, that big around, so hopefully they'll just, you know, hopefully they'll break loose, and then we can get the starter working on it. We get the starter working on it. We're going to run all that marvel mystery oil out and after it gets out then we're going to uh, put spark plugs back in it put gas on it and we're going to drive it to butts county probably ain't gonna happen but we're gonna try no. we don't have a clue y'all we ain't much for volkswagen bugs we like i like them better than i like chevrolets but i don't particularly like these so uh we're gonna keep working y'all we love chevrolets we love volkswagens we love fords we love dodges anything with an engine that we can have fun and see if we can get to run we enjoy it i know some of y'all get upset with me and i make fun of chevrolets but uh i'm just playing i'm just having a good time y'all just have a good time with me because i promise you it don't bother me uh that i'm having a good time you can talk about fords and i ain't gonna cry i ain't not a bit not a bit not a bit this little engine is stuck y'all and after i got my mountain dew i just started kind of yeehawing it on right there it's a 30 millimeter bolt here for the crank. We ain't got one of them. We tap there, we tap there. We know this is bad. Got Marvel Mystery oil on all of them. Starter's ticking. That engine's stuck. Oh. But we ain't prone to giving up. I mean, we trying to see what kind of leverage we can get. Uh, you know, put it in gear and drag it down the road. I mean, there's a lot of different things we can do. Um, but she ain't being easy. She ain't being easy. She, 
I'm going to the Atlanta Hawks game tonight with my boy. That was one of his Christmas gifts. So uh, we're going to go ride Marta, and we're going to go see the Atlanta Hawks play basketball. And uh, we're going to have fun. But hopefully I'm able to tell J.C. if he gets home from school how good this Volkswagen ran. Uh, we're just going to try to pull it off. Hold up. You hooked on the... No, you're not. Just hit it. There you go. Hit it again. <laughs> Hit her again, old man. Hit it with some yeehaw. Hit it and go. There you go. That's what we need to do when we get these tires changed. We're good. All right, that pulled it out far enough that we can jack this side up now. This is your better side here. This you going to town side. Yeah, they got a couple bits in that. Yeah, that old, that old bull didn't get to this side. But we're going to get these two tires on. And after we get these two tires on, the old man don't know it. But we're going to sit inside of it, and I'm going to be putting it, popping the clutch. One more, one more. While I'm trying to turn. While you driving it down the road. <laughs> and we'll get it out of gear. <laughs> don't. Was Jay? Oh, I mean, with a tow dolly. Just driving it down the road like it is. Ain't that much traffic. You the last one that came down this road. <laughs> we put tires on it and pop it. We can get it to break loose. These two wheels off. And then we're going to make a loop in the yard at least. And uh, hopefully, hopefully we can get this engine to break loose. Old man said, let's put it on the car dolly and do that. That'd be fine too. Uh, <laughs> but uh, we're gonna make it happen, y'all. I tell you what, it looks better with uh, full pumped up tires, don't it, old man? Looking at this side, it don't look a bad car. <laughs> oh yeah, it's a good car on this side. This side Got one little ding on this fender here. One, one little cool ding. Out. Well, don't get to talking too much because it's got dings everywhere. You know what kind of line doesn't roar, old man? Uh -uh. A dandelion. A dandelion. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. I got all of them, y'all. I don't know why. They just come to me every now and again. Uh, so what's the plan? I know this front wheel's stuck. Old man, don't remember this, but I think we worked on this one before. <laughs> that's an old 16 penny, old 8 penny. That's a big one. That's, that's, a, 16, that's a big old penny nail cotter key. <laughs> I bet y'all's cotter key won't last as long as that one will. We would have done broke a cotter key off. <laughs> That's bad though. We're gonna tear a transmission up if that cotter key was ever supposed to break, old man. It wasn't gonna break, was it? Uh, I don't know, it's rusted. It might break. Yeah. All right, we gotta get the castle nut off and then I think we can just put the puller on it, right? I hope. <laughs> we don't know how these old wheels work, but it looks like that's looking like how it has to be. So we're going to get that off, get the puller on it. We'll pull it so the wheel will work. Is it left-handed or right-handed? All right, we're going to hope this pulls it off and we don't tear up the front of these uh, Volkswagen brakes. Yes, well, an old man. Get us some we turn it. No. I'm going to turn it. I want you to pull it off. Go. I don't I think I'm hitting the bearing. Not yet. Go. Yeah, Go. I am. Man. Oh. We're good. Old man's going to get these bearings out. We're going to get this front wheel pulled off. We're going to try to loosen up these brakes so we can get this front wheel to turn. But we can't get this castle nut off the back. I put some lefty, loosey, righty, tighty juice on it. I even put some MAP Pro Power on it and can't get that rouse going to loosen up. We ain't got a old man still trying to get this thing to turn. So uh, we're going to get that bearing out and get that one off. So we'll know we have three of the four turning. And then what we'll have to do is uh, get some double manpower on this back and we'll get it off. Yeah. Uh, but we're going to get that on. Guess what, old man? Turn it. Ooh, it turned All right. Joker turn free. It ain't blocked, we got three out of the four. See. All right, y'all. We couldn't figure out how to get 
the shaft out to pull the brakes. That's got a puller hole on it, but I don't know if you drill something in there to hold it in a certain way, but we couldn't get it off. So we're gonna do the old drag technique. We're gonna hook her up and drag her down the road. But now, old man, get your foot out the way. Out. Ah, come her down. And then we're gonna try to find our uh, cotter. Key, there it is right there. I can go get y'all another nail. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Ah. Somebody's gonna tell us the easy way of getting these brakes off, but we ain't figured it out. All right, get in it, brother Wayne. <laughs> you good? I got a problem. I can't see nothing. <laughs> All right, every wheel's turning except this backing. Come on, baby. Turn? Nope, not yet. Oh, it's wanting to. Turn it. It's wanting to. <laughs> Come on, baby. Nope. <laughs> Sliding easy now. Looked like when it backed off that it loosened up a little bit. If that thing does free up, how is he going to stop it? That's why you got to... That's why we ought to put it on a tow dive. No, we good. He can't stop it. What if the chain comes loose? Then you're going to drive it He's to the gonna ditch. He's going to run it in the ditch. I'm going to run it in. No, I'll tell you, I'm going to run it upside down. We'll be fine. You just get out the way of it. You can't be, if it breaks what? loose, you got to get out the way. Which way are you going to go? Go the flat way. I'll let him do it. I'll let him do it. Yeah, I'll drive it. Y'all, this probably ain't a good idea. We're going to try it anyway. Let's go, boys. You want to wrench it off first? I can see. I can see enough. I'm going to have the door open anyway. If I got to bail, I'm going to bail. Go. It tried pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Brother Wayne said it drives pretty good. I don't think the old man wants to do this. Uh. Anyway, got it in neutral. Yeah, I got the camera. It's on. Yeah, I won't. Who says Volkswagen won't go on three wheels? <laughs> this Volkswagen to roll on three of them. Now we will. Come on, baby, break loose. Break loose. Break loose. Break loose. Break loose. Break loose. She ain't turning yet. It does, yep. Got some old bale or something in here. Huh? Got an old bale or something in here. 
I do. Just break it loose. I'm not standing around. That ain't gonna... If it moves, it will know it. Yeah, that puts some real torque on it. Don't know it. That'll put as much torque as we've done yet. Give it a little snatch. That's what it needs to do. Just give it a little snatch, old man. <laughs> it's trying to look good. It is. I've got it. Oh, it turned it. Back up some. It did turn it. It did, yeah, back up some. It turned it. It turned it down to the bottom. It's the dog is going back and forth, Johnny. Instead of trying to drag it forward. I got to bring it back and forth. It did turn. Yeah, it did. I hit her again. I, mean, I got to see that. <laughs> yeah, we got it spinning in, the, in reverse. Do it again. Back up and do it again. Yes. Do it again. Yeah, let's turn it now. <laughs> what was that, Brother Wayne? Three Stooges. Yeah. Oh. Three Stooges. Oh. It's moving. Back it up. Oh, more? Well, no, we got room. Hold on. Don't go yet. <laughs> yeah, don't go yet. For sure. The three Stooges are working. Might need another wheel for this you said and doing. How about that? It's moving. Let me drive the truck and you want it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he didn't think it was going to work, but it's turning I didn't it. Either. It's moving now. You see that? Yeah. Do it again. Do it again. Oh, I think it's unstuck. I think it's freed up then, don't you? Yeah, I do too. I don't still think. hanging up. We got a little hanging up right there. Try to go the other way. Now, we've been doing all this backwards. So you go back the other way, it may come on loose. I think the transmission's locked up. That's what you think? Something was turning. Push the clutch in. If that was the case, it was in gear. It was in gear? Yep. Okay, now it's turning. It turned a little bit. I do that with it in gear. Yeah. See if it turns back. Well, that's in. what we want to do. Yeah. You it hasn't turned that yet. We can see you where we're going. You put a shot of gas it. in it and you ain't got to fool no dog. <laughs> yeah, just drive it on to the house. See, back wheel's unstuck. Yeah, now we're still going to have to pull it from the back because this tire is flat. No. Yeah. This tire ain't flat. It ain't flat, but look at that smig spot. Ooh. Flat spot. It won't hurt until you come up on a curve. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to go drag it down the road now that we got them turning so I can pop it in gear and see if we can break That's the, true. See if we can break that loose. Remember, you can turn around and go up this way. <laughs> and it rolls and now. Division. Now it's rolling. Them people that stuff they do this kind of stuff all the time. <laughs> they drive them dirt bikes and floor waders, just thousands of them run down through here. Nobody cares. I don't care. It's rolling now. I ain't had a tag and insurance on my car in 20 years. Well, you can't get it out. <laughs> can't get what out? You go forward. That ain't no fun, though. I ain't into the tow dollars, in it? Hit something. Tow dollars. All right, go forward. <laughs> Whew. This thing rolling slick as a whistle now. We couldn't get it rolled a while ago because we was slipping the clutch. Got now. <laughs> On that side. Whew, you done scratched the paint back here, old man. <laughs> hey, look what it did to the tow dollars. <laughs> Now, how you gonna stop it? We ain't got brakes. Okay, then. We need to put it on a two dollar. Come on, old man. David, Push a little further. A hurt somebody. We got a clutch. I can put it in the clutch and it'll slow down more than your truck wheel. He wants to try to roll it off. It? Yeah, he wants to try to free the motor. But I think he's gonna rip the front and get the clutch out of it. It didn't yet. Well, they will be now. Are you gonna prime the top right first? No, sir. I don't want to crank it. We ain't got no plugs here. Oh. Yeah. All I'm trying to do is get it. And we put oil down in the pistons. All right, y'all. I'm gonna hook it up, and we're gonna drag it down the road again. Yeah. Well, let's do it. Let's tear the transmission out. Let's go. <laughs> 
He don't want to have fun, Mr. Wayne. It's in neutral now, but I don't. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Daddy! Stop! Stop! I can't get it in the gear. I can't, the, the clutch pedal, ain't, it ain't going in the gear. So if I can't get it in the gear, I couldn't stop. See, what it's doing is I can't push the clutch in and let it go into neutral. Yeah. I, the, the car's got to be stopped before it'll disengage the clutch. So what I was wanting to do is get it rolling and put it in the gear and pop the clutch, but it's not allowing me to do that. So now we, I've just got to roll back. we got to unhook you it. you got to put it in neutral and let you, and you're going to guide it back in there. Yep. Be cold again tonight. Turn it. Nope. Turning the boat a little. <laughs> it didn't turn a lick. You going to take the motor out of it? Yep, we are. Woo! Oh, it ain't turning. I'll ask Terry about that other motor and all up there in that barn. Breaking in, uh, of course, we're already on the way. The old man is already pulling it home. There were some issues that caused us not be able to get this engine to turn over. One, it's locked. Uh, and two, of course, we would have drug it with the dolly, just with the back two tires on the ground, and would have been popping the clutch like in third gear, maybe second gear, and popping the clutch in and out until we got that engine to break loose. Um, the reason we did not do that is cause the clutch, the cable that goes from the, the pedal uh, to release the clutch is broke. So that, something flying over and scared me to death. Uh, but that's the reason we could not get it undone. Uh, so now um, all it would do is while the engine was still, uh, while the car was still, we could pop it in, put it into gear, and then let it go, and it would work. But it wouldn't go into gear when it was rolling. And uh, so that really wasn't helping me much. So that wasn't good. Uh, so now, um, now the old man is, is back here, and we're hoping we're going to find, uh, find our way back. And... Uh, hey, Jerry scared the heck out of me. <laughs> it scared the heck out of me, too. I didn't have a clue what it was. It was some kind of loud. I thought that Volkswagen was cranking up. I thought it had come across. Woo! <laughs> All right, shit. All right, hey, you good? I'm gonna go it on home. Jake's tires start smoking. Yep, well this ain't, what is this? This is 142, he says. All right. Take a right. So there'll be another installment on this one. Most of the time we like to uh, like to get them running in one episode, but y'all guess what? This one wasn't one of them. Well, y'all for myself, we thank y'all. Of course, I, hopefully there's been something on this crazy episode that we have earned your subscription. We have a good time doing this. This is actually more of a rescue than anything else. 
But y'all keep watching. We're gonna break this loose, let this oil sit in a little while, and we're gonna see if we can get this engine to break loose and get it running. We thank y'all so very much for watching. For myself, for Mr. Wayne, for the old man, we wanna say thank y'all. We know no way of closing any of these out than saying deuces. May God bless. Hey, we want to thank you all again for watching this video. If you're not subscribed to the channel, you can do so by clicking this button down below, or you can watch a video that may be suited for you or a recent upload uh, here down below. So once again, we thank you for watching. Deuces. May God bless.